What is up, guys? Shadowmaster EX here, and I'm bringing you part two, episode two, number two, playthrough number two. <laughs> Let me stop. But in all, all seriousness, we've got the next part of Pokemon Zeta, and today we are going to do the Naragrex, the, the Naragrex Forest. I think that's how you say that. We're going to take that on, get to the next tent town. Wow, almost at 10. Get to the Naragex Forest. That is what you are, that is what I will call you. And I should actually take this thing out from front since it has Illuminate. Are you fucking kidding me? No. I just said I should take this thing out from front, and I didn't. These are all kind of better captures than Aurorus. Like, I'm not trying to be a hater or anything, but it's kind of true. And I'm thinking about it, I think I should leave this thing in front, because even though we've got the damn Illuminate ability, the, the, our best chance for running away from the fights that we can't win is probably this thing. So, Politoed, eh? I think I want to kill you. Oh, I can't, because... Oh, it needs spark! I'm surprised I got through that grass and I didn't get an encounter. So, Pokeball. Not bad. Do you know the li oh, I don't want to hear it. Oh no, shit! Ah, oh, that's not what I meant. No, no! Yes. Cool. Some trainers are stronger than others. In every city, the strongest trainers will band together to make a gym. The strongest of these is called a gym leader. Only powerful trainers can challenge a gym leader. Are you a powerful trainer? Yes. Hmm. Would you like to back that up? I still have a Pokemon for my days as a trainer. We can battle if you'd like. Well then, let's go at it, shall we? I'm probably about to get decked. This old ass man's probably gonna send in like Kyogre. The Enfu, that's. It's not Kyogre. So I'm not gonna fool around here, I'm just gonna go for bubbles. Because if I've learned anything from these scary ass, threatening ass Pokemon that keep popping up, it's to just kill them. Don't give them the time to hurt you, kill them. Okay, it's just your attack. As long as it's not your special defense, I'm fine. Because I doubt you're going to hurt me very badly with Pound. Yeah, see, you just did like six points. I'm good. Die. So, Gentleman Matthew has been defeated. You proved your point. Well then, that's fine. And take this for good measure. Ooh! I feel like I'm gonna need that. A great ball is, a sp is special because it has a higher catch rate than a Pokeball. If there's a Pokemon you want really badly, well, this will make it easier to catch. Thank you, sir. I feel like that item wasn't always a great ball, but given the challenge lock that I'm doing, like since I said Nuzlocke randomizer, the item's probably changed to that. And man, I have seen enough of these motherfuckers. Because, uh, for Reborn, I'm grinding up a Pokemon currently, and... Oh my god. This is the only thing I can fight it with. And they... It was, it was bad. I'll tell you about that later. But, uh... Yeah, I'm liking Zeta so far. I really... Oh, you fucking dick. You asshole. Alright, so... Take the... Exp that wasn't even worth... Oh. Oh god. It's like there's smoke coming into my room. We have to get we have to leave the forest and go heal. Heat more. I'm gonna bubble you. Incinerate. Eating it up! Bubble for the kill. 
This is dangerous, trying to battle while I'm poisoned, but like... Oh wow, that's not anywhere near good experience. Like, I thought that was gonna be amazing, but it, it kind of really wasn't. So, potion time, because I want to make sure I make it back to the center, because I don't know if you, like, die to poison in this game or not. And then even if you don't, there's still all these wild Pokemon that want to challenge me. So I don't want to have too little... It Aww. Okay, avoided the grass, skillfully, I might add. No! Oh, I'm so bad. Aww. Why are you higher than my Aurorus? That hardly seems fair, but okay. Get out of my way, kid. Alright. We made it. I honestly don't know how I feel because, like, we are clearly getting attacked by threatening Pokemon. Like, last episode we had the Groudon. This episode we had the fucking Rayquaza. I don't know how we're gonna survive this lock. Like, what? Oh my god, I just realized third gen is coming back to try and kill me. They, were, they weren't pleased with how the Sapphire Randomizer ended. They thought I should have had a harder time with the champion, as I did too. So they showed up, and they're like, Nope, we're going to make sure you lose. We're getting you killed. So let's just keep moving. Let's keep moving, and let's just try to not let that happen. God damn it. Executor. Tempting, but since you kill my whole team currently, no. Even though I'm pretty sure all he had was like barrage, probably. Oh, dude! <sighs> it's a blazes. Damn it! I want you. Oh, um, I've got lantern. Electrode. Not fucking with you, cause you can blow up, and I'm not having it. Nope, I'm not having it. Okay. Progress is being made. Do you fight? Shh. I'm on a mission for the Pokemon Rangers. I'm trying to track down a rare Pokemon. I mean, it's a randomizer, dude. They're all rare. Alright, so I, I'm pretty sure this is a trainer battle right here, so we just gotta get rid of this. Oh, God, it's an Umbreon. That's kind of powerful. You didn't want to fight? Why did I turn around if you didn't fight me anyway? Fuck. What? What? Fuck that. Fuck all of that. Do you fight? They say Devin, the superior town gym leader, uses fighting type Pokemon. Flying is good against fighting. Maybe we could catch something on Route 301. Oh! 301?! I'm never gonna see that number. <laughs> I'm never gonna, like, let's be honest, I'm never gonna see that number. Ooh, Petra Bear. Ooh, if we could've gotten to these a little sooner, that would've been pretty nice. And wow, Illuminate is really annoying. I can't wait till our other team members are actually, like, stronger, because I need to get away from these Pokemon. And I can only do that by having a high-level Pokemon. That's not Harry Ot Makuhita. See, why can't we- I, I actually want to encounter more Pokemon like Caterpie right at this moment. Like, once we get to a new place, I don't. But right now, I'm fine with Caterpie. That's <laughs> a pinnacle. <laughs> This is truly random. This is truly random. We've seen Gen 5 and Gen 1. We've seen everything damn there. It's a Hypno. The Hypno looks awfully sad. Perhaps she's worried about someone. Aww. Alright, so we went the wrong way. Time to go the right way. Damn, we almost got out of the grass. Wow. So a Lily- Ooh, that's power. That's power. These things are annoying as fuck. I'm so glad I didn't have to fight that thing. Fuck. Fuck. 
Illuminate is so annoying. <laughs> uh, Mudkip, why? Damn it. Damn. Route 301, can we catch something here? I feel like one of the other guys is from 301. Yeah, you're from 301, so we can't. I can switch. I'll switch you to the front. Just so I can go get that item. What? Fuck. Alright, well, I might as well try and fight this thing. Decent. Di don't hit. Ugh. Really? Nope. Not playing that game. So a Dusk Ball. I've, are all the items going to be Pokeballs? Because I I get where you're coming from. That's cool and all. I need that. But at the same damn time, I, I need some new moves and stuff. And stuff to help my actual Pokemon. So let's go ahead and get rested up. Nice and rest. Nice and rest. And how much money do we have? We've got like nothing. Wow. Wow. Damn. He's fucking green. So what do we got here? Hey kid, can you do me a favor? Can you go to the Wonder Cave in the northeast of this town and find the legend researcher? He went in there with Devin a couple hours ago. Could you go in there and tell him the shipment has arrived? He'll know what I'm talking about. Okay, that didn't sound sketchy. So we can get an encounter in here. I wonder what it'll be. You better put lantern in front. And this is the role I'm going to play as, because this is an actual Nuzlocke mode, but I don't think it understands that legendaries are incredibly difficult to catch. So what I'm going to do, quick save here, and if my first encounter is legendary, I'm turning it off and we're going again. Oh, well, first we're going to fight this guy. hi -yah! So we've got Black Belt Tyler with a single quill. This is too easy. I feel bad. Except I really don't, honestly. Oh, wow, you ate that up. Oh, God. Time to miss all of my moves, I guess. Ooh, shit. Maybe we can get this thing. This thing's just all over my stats. Get up off me, dog. What the fuck? So that's a dead Cyndaquil. Not bad. And that is a level 11 Nightlight. Defeated again! Oh, sucks. Alright, our first encounter is... I want you so bad! I want you so bad! My question is, will this thing kill me in one hit? I hope not. I don't know what moves this thing has this early on. Growth, ooh, that's scary actually. That's scary. Let's send in hands. Okay, the paralysis, that's good. That's good. Tackle. Alright, this thing's too set up. I gotta go for a ball right here. I wish you had a fire type right now, so just switch it in to be safe. But to be fair, I don't even know what this thing has. Like, for all I know, it might not even have a good move. Let's go for a dust ball, because we are in a cave. I wish I was recording this at night like I always am, because then our chances would be even better. Oh god. Alright, fully paired. Oh, I d oh god, that would have made me so sad. Great ball, let's try a great ball. Come on, Mulligan. I really want you, I really want you, come on. No! Leech seed, oh god, that's not good. All 
right, we have to go for another. We have to weaken this thing more. So it's got leech seed growth. I don't know what else. But man, this is scary. This is scary. I, I don't want to lose. I don't want to lose hands, but I don't want to lose the Lilligan either. Damn it, I thought we had it. Mega Drain! Oh god. I think we gotta run from this one. Oh no. I've gotta switch. I have to send an Aurora. And Aurora's probably gonna die. Leech Seed. I'm gonna try one last time. I know it's at full health, but I really want to believe that we can catch this thing. Nope. Alright, we gotta leave. Oh, and Aurora's dead. This is so stupid. I really wanted this thing. I really did. And then we lost Aurora, who could have been a really good team member, too. It's so stupid. So instead of going up one Pokemon, we just went down one. And I want to look at this just to see. Yeah, since it's the challenge mode, it didn't even heal Aurora. We'll store you in box 24. That will be our dead box. So let's go name it appropriately. And it's a rocket box, of course it is. So, there's our dead box. <sighs> let's keep going, I guess. I don't even remember where I'm going. So Spiritomb, eh? Why was the Lilligant so high level? That's what I want to know. That's what I really, really want to know. I don't understand how that was fair. Oh god, it's a Mawile? That's irritating. So, let's make it a little less irritating, why don't we? Special defense? Are you are you a special mawile now? Is that what you're trying to do? Cause it's not gonna work. No siree. So we're looking okay. Oh damn, this thing is a tax stat. Must be really good if it did that much to Oh, it's gotta have huge power. No chance it doesn't. No chance in hell it doesn't. I want this thing, like, permanently confused. I missed. Yep. This is really weird. You would think it would have another move, like, to attack me with. But I guess not. Guess not. Are you gonna actually go on the offensive? Or no? Hit yourself, please. That'll nearly kill you. Yes. And that'll be the end of Mrs. Mawile. We'll probably miss Mawile. That's probably not going to give us a level. Nope. Sometimes I'm better off staying at home. Whatever, dude. 
It's pretty dark in here, isn't it? Yeah, you ain't lying, pal. You ain't lying. It's dark in here. That Lilligant killed my Pokemon. Yeah, it's pretty dark. So, Seismitoad. This thing has water absorb, I swear to God. Alright, cool. I can at least hit you with my move. Round does... Damage. Not good damage, but damage. So, how about we have some time right We got time right now. Why don't we have a little conversation about the question of the day. As you'll see somewhere on the screen, because I haven't created the layout yet, so I don't know where it's going to be p placed, but somewhere on the screen, near or next to or under or above this video, you shall see the question of the day. What is your, what is the stupidest death that you have ever had in a Nuzlocke, if you've ever, like, attempted the Nuzlocke challenge? I'm pretty sure that set up Lilligant was the dumbest thing that's ever happened to me. At least... Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's the dumbest thing that's ever happened to me. I mean, trainers can hax you and stuff, but that's Pokemon. That's the game we play. A Pokemon setting up and doing everything that Lilligant does, that doesn't normally happen in the wild. So I'm going to go ahead and ditch Flail, because Flail helps us in no way, shape, or form. Whereas Water Gun, the ooh. Perfect, but actually I'm gonna go into hands because this thing probably has sturdy and an arm thrust from a Makuhito will not only break the sturdy, but if we're lucky it'll kill him too. And I would love a dead rog and roller right about now. I would love dead rog and roll. Oh wow, you're eating it up. And of course we only get two hits. Yeah, and you harden, yay. Fucking jackass. Let's see what the vital throw will do. Almost killed him. I think we can do it with arm thrust now. Oh yeah. That thing is gone. So, as you're watching this, I'm pretty sure it'll be one day before I move into my new place. One or two days before. So, I would love it if you guys would wish me luck in this new chapter of my life and stick with me because I'm hoping to just keep bringing you content I might slow down a little bit but hopefully I'm gonna have to teach that to Lantern aren't I I'm gonna have to teach that to Lantern and that is depressing we got an IV stone not even bad but yeah support me guys I'm gonna need it Plus, I love you guys. That's why I keep making content, and that's why I'm going to continue to try and make content, even when I'm in a new location, because I want to entertain you guys. I've said it many times before, but I love entertaining people. I really do. If someone tells me I'm funny, or if I make someone laugh or smile, it brings some warmth to my heart, because I know that I'm brightening someone else's day, and that brightens my day. So hopefully I can continue to do the same with you guys in my videos. Ninja Strike, watch ya! This stupid ass ninja interrupting our heart to heart. He must die. What? Where is he? Where'd he go? All right. I'll, yeah, I'll fight him with Lantern. Why not? Let's see what a water gun will do, because I think this thing's kind of... We gotta switch. We're not gonna sit here. Oh, this is a stall game. I do not wish to play. I don't want to play it. No. Ah, uh, he didn't copy shit, bitch. Catch this vital throw. No! I should've went for... God damn it. Oh, I guess it didn't even matter. Man, Peeny, you suck. You're so bad. <laughs> Alright, Ninja J is done. I concede defeat. Ninja Skype! Escape. Ninja Strike! Watch I will kill you. I will murder you. I will 6-0 you with the two Pokemon I have. 
So Crow, boy. That's a Pokemon. That is a Pokemon. So we're gonna hit you with a T-Wave because you're scary. Even though I resist one of your stabs and you probably don't even have that stab, I am still petrified of you because you are a Crobat. You are a respectable Mon and I will not, I will not sleep on you, no. No, 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 no. I will assess the threat accordingly. See, look at that, he ate that up. Ugh, fucking bulky ass bat. Can we get a crit? Can we get a confuse hacks? Thank you. At least I got one of the things I asked for. I think we can kill him with this water gun. Can we get this crowbat? Yes, we can. We did it. Way to go, Nightlight. I swear, if we lose Nightlight, I don't think we'll be able to continue. I honestly don't. I concede defeat as well. Ninja escape! Bitch, it's a scape. Alright, where am I now? Aw, oh, fucking Christ. I hate... Nope. Because you can get magical leave. And I'm not, hit I'm not catching a magical leave. Being a Pokemon Ranger is so awesome. I can explore cool places, meet cute girls. Fuck you, bitch. I bet girls think you're disgusting. So Pokemon Ranger Robert is sending in a Reggie Gigas. This is stupid. Okay, I thought he had Limber or some dumb shit for a second. I was going to be really mad. Dizzy Punch. Supersonic, bitch. Catch this Parafusion! If only I had a move that would flinch. Alright, time to switch in to hands. Because we want to kill this thing as soon as possible. Because I know what slow start is. And I know what it does if I don't appropriately check it. So, Foresight. You see, normally I would be mocking him for having that. But. He has Dizzy Punch. Oh, yes. Can we get the kill? Close. It's okay, though, because we've got Arm Thrust. So, we pro-played that Reggie Kikis. <laughs> Thank God for that, too, because I, I wasn't looking forward to getting, like, demolished by a legendary. Wow, he almost leveled. I can't impress girls without my Pokemon. I'm not gonna lie, that was an impressive Pokemon you sent out. Not many people have that. I mean, I got a fucking lantern. And I think now would be an appropriate time to use a healing item. Yes. Yes, yes. We are looking somewhat better than we were before. Hey you! Let's warm up this cold cave! That sounds kinda gay. So cool trainer Owen would like to battle, and he's sending in a Corsola. I have no problems with switching into hands right now. Unless this thing has like side beam for some dumb reason. Tackle? Pfft. Pfft. Whatever. We're gonna go for the vital throw. Because Tackle doesn't do enough to scare me, and Vital Throw does more than enough to kill you. So not even bad. That's a level for you, and you want to learn Fake- Ooh, we want Fake Out. We really do. And I will get rid of... I get rid of Tackle. Because Normals aren't good for anything unless you have Refrigerate, Aerialate, or Pixelate. So Cricketune is coming in. Cricketune is coming through. Cricketune is here. Cricketune in the morning, guys. Hello. I love this cry. Listen to this cry. It's so nice. Oh, wait, no. Fuck. Cricketot. I thought it was Cricketune. Oh man. That's really disappointing, actually. 
I got really excited because I thought I was going to hear my favorite Pokemon cry. And then I didn't. This thing gets shed skin. I'm so done with you, Cricketot. I should have done that from the beginning. I really should have. Can we level off that? Wow. I'm colder than ever. Whatever. I think we're almost to the promise point. Oh, dude! Oh! I just got done recording Trainer Card Wednesday. And that's a couple days ahead. Or, er, yeah. But you guys will see it after the. You'll see it before this goes up. And you will realize that there were two Pokemon in said episode that I stated explicitly that I loved. We could have caught them both, but Lilligant showed up and ruined our time. <sighs> this is gonna be one of those locks. I know it is. At least we got our level. And I really don't know how much longer it'll be until these guys stop listening to me, so I'm kind of afraid of that. But at the same damn time, I want to be overleveled because I only have two Pokemon. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. It's Dictini. And he crits me as I insult him. Wow. Wow, Victini, you're so cool. Alright, so we went first, so he's not quick attacking. He is confusioning. Don't get the confusion. Yes, die. Oh no, you knew you were gonna die, so you used a quick attack. And you. It's a crit! Fuck! I'm so fucking tired of these trainers. Defeated again! Yeah, get the fuck out. So let's go ahead and heal. We should. I, I feel like we're near the end. It's not that way. How do we get over there? I might. Oh, trainer. More trainers! And oh man, I gotta get away from you. Nothing's changed with my team. You can still kill us all. I kind of have a crush on Owen, and Owen likes Megan, and I don't even know if Megan likes boys at all. Being a ranger is so complicated. What the hell? Oh, oh okay, I understand. I, I didn't need to hear any of that. I don't care, but whatever. You have a tyrant here. Abide, I'm so glad I went for a T-Wave. I will switch in. Good old hands. I will fake out. And then I will go for the vital throw. Don't flinch. Yeah, die, Tyron. You little bitch. Pokemon Ranger Rita has been defeated. Darn it! Oh man, I did not want to fight. Galvan- Ah, oh, you're so good. You're a good Pokemon. I respect and love you, Galvantula. Hmm, but how can we actually get it to emerge? I don't know, man. I'm just here to bust open rocks. I may need you to bust it open after all. Huh? It's warm. Did you do this? Well, whatever you're doing, it's working. Quick, put your hand on that stone. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm not ready to battle. I'm not ready to battle! I don't want to fucking battle ever. Oh, God. It randomized to a Dusknoir. We can't even touch him with Makohita. I 
I don't know what a Dusknor has this early. I don't know. I'm, I'm afraid, I'm intimidated, and I'm afraid. So we know he's got Leer and Foresight so far. He doesn't have Bide, does he? Alright, so he doesn't have Bide. That's good news. Foresight again, alright. Okay, I see you. I'm confused by you, but I see you. You're gonna go for Leer again. I feel like I'm gonna catch a really scary attack. Just because he's making me think that he can't attack me. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and heal. <sighs> Almost out of healing items, that's not good. That's not good. That's not good. That's actually really bad. Foresight. If that's the only moves you can do, I would be deeply appreciative if that's all you do. And if that's not, I'd be really happy if all you did was that. Like, come on, man. Okay, I just looked him up on Cerebi. He has really good- he has all the punches as base moves, but I don't know if Randomizer will give you base moves. It sure would be nice if I could catch this thing, because that's a perfect catch range. That's- oh, man. That was a lot of EXP. Oh, wow, an unknown. They're quite the rare Pokemon. Only unknown only show themselves when there's great power about. You must have a bright future. It's totally my lantern. Hey, why are you here anyways? Oh, my package arrived? Excellent. I have to go. Shadow X, I think you should go to Fianga City. It's to the southwest of here. My friend Wilson has a laboratory there. I'd, rec I'd recommend you see him. I'm sure he'll be very interested in you. It's quite a feat to conquer a Pokemon as rare as unknown. You should come check out my gym. I warn you, though. I'm much harder to beat than an unknown. They have to go. Shadow X, Devin, thanks for all your help. After you, Shadow X. Um, how do I get out? Linoon. It's a Linoon, guys. It's Linoon. Am I going the wrong way. <sighs> I hate, I hate flash caves. So much. So, so, so much. So, this is what we do. I think... Oh, it did it! He did it! Yes! Now, is there anywhere I can go and catch a Pokemon real fast? Oh god. I'm literally gonna have to do this gym with just two. Um in the I think we'll take on the gym in the next episode. I think that's a safe bet. I think that is a safe bet. So we're gonna go ahead and save the game right here. And we're going to end it off, so if you enjoyed today's really scary episode in which we lost a good team member who didn't even get to reach their full potential, leave a like and a comment down below. Don't forget to answer the question of the day as well. What is the dumbest, most bullshit death you've ever had happen to you while you're playing a lock? And I guess I will see you guys next time in episode 3 of our Pokemon Zeta Randomizer Nuzlocke. Peace.